Hey guys, it's the Solo Coffee, and today in Solo's Monster Analysis video, we're going to be going over Krampus Killjoy, and I'm going to be telling you guys whether or not you should get him out of his current breeding event. So let's go ahead and get right into it. Alright, so Krampus Killjoy is an attacker, and his traits are Freeze Immunity, Possession Immunity, and Cooldown Immunity. Those are all very bad traits, actually. None of those are really good at all. So don't really worry about ranking him up just for his traits. And his relics are Sword and Sword, which are alright. And then if we go on down to his pros and cons, he has access to two free skills as an attacker. He also has access to two water damaging skills as a dark monster. He has a nice self buff. They say that he has a nice trait, but honestly, I don't really agree with that. It isn't too great. I guess it could be okay, but it definitely isn't good. And then he has zero cooldown, 65 damage skill, and dark hook, which is pretty good, meaning he's fine against cooldown activation. But then he has cooldown immunity anyway, so he doesn't really need that. And then he has amazing power. He's got great relic swap and damage output and he has very low cooldowns and then his only cons are horrible speed and moderate to high stamina costs and then we have his recommended moves are right here we have a dark hook which is a zero cooldown move but it also does 65 dark damage which is pretty good then he also has an aoe freeze with 40 water damage which is pretty good he also has an aoe random torture effect which is interesting that could be good if you get something good and then he also has three moves you can pick from right here we have a brutal for 40 water damage and freeze and then the mysterious one does 55 dark damage with a random torture effect and then unchained does a self stun immunity with stamina regen in an extra turn honestly out of those i would probably go with the random torture effect just because it does more damage and of course the random torture is pretty good as well and it does only have one cooldown so yeah, overall he has some pretty good moves he has the aoe freeze for denial and then he has some really great moves besides that for like tortures and just damage output so yeah pretty great monster i do recommend that you guys go ahead and get Krampus Killjoy. He is pretty good, especially since he's in a breeding match, so he's very easy to get. So yeah, it's definitely worth it. Go ahead and get him. Let me know down in the comments what you guys think of him, and I'll see you in the next one. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Goodbye.